Everyone has their favorite way to make mashed potatoes, but have you ever tried making mashed potatoes like this? Today, I'm gonna make mashed potatoes using canned potatoes. Maybe you don't have any money for fresh potatoes and all you have is canned. Maybe there's a snowstorm and you only have canned in the house. Maybe you don't wanna peel and cook potatoes because this is pretty much heat, mash, and eat. Whatever your reason is, today, I'm gonna try it with canned potatoes. I'm Jamie with Savory Saver. I share gluten-free recipes, tips, tricks, and resources to make your gluten-free lifestyle easier. So let's get started. So this isn't gonna take long at all. I've got one 14 and a half ounce can of potatoes. You can use any kind you want, whole, diced, or sliced. I did rinse them off. You don't have to, but I drained them, so I just rinsed them off as well. Probably it would have been just as easy to rinse them off in the can, shake it around, and then drain the water again. A little bit of water is not going to hurt. A couple of these are a little bigger, so I'm just going to break them in half just to make them more the size of the other ones. So let's put them in the pot. This could not be easier. I'm going to put a few tablespoons of milk in the bottom. Now I'm going to turn the heat on. I've got it on medium. I'm going to bring the milk in there up to a boil and warm those potatoes through just until they're done. So three to five minutes. All right, our milk's boiling, so I'm just gonna stir it a little bit to warm everything through. All right, I think these are heated through, so I'm gonna turn it off. So let's add some butter. I'm gonna add some salt, pepper, and then my mashed potatoes, I like a little bit of garlic powder, and I also like a little bit of onion powder. Let's mash them up. Once they are as mashed as you'd like, go ahead and test for seasoning or maybe add a little more milk if you think they're not fluffy enough for you. Let's get these off the burner and give them a taste. All right, about five minutes of time, no peeling, hardly any cost. Let's give them a try. They're pretty thick. I think they're good. If you're okay with canned potatoes or like I said, maybe you can't get out of the house and that's all you have. These are easy. Five minutes of time, hardly any work. That was one can. That's enough to serve Tara and I. If you have a bigger family, use two cans, double the other ingredients, but nothing wrong with those potatoes. And if canned is all you have, there's a way to serve them. Guys, that's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching. Do you have recipes that you use canned potatoes for? If you do, I'd love to hear about them. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.